like if we didn't have the environment, we wouldn't have most of the food that comes on our plates. Nine-year-old fourth grade student Catriona is one of 1,200 leaving their elementary school this week trading textbooks for tree saplings. I'm pretty cozy in my big jacket. The dream started because of the fire and we wanted to have children learn how to plant trees. For the first time ever, these Sam's Valley elementary students are getting their hands dirty for a good cause. Replanting areas of Josephine County forest land burned by wildfire. Well, when you learn inside, the experiments are different than when you learn outside. Because if you learn outside, then you could do big experiments. More than 18,000 students have planted upwards of 75,000 trees in a full circle effort. Josephine County invests in the seedlings and the students get hands on learning. The timber and forest products are the number one industry in the state of Oregon. And that, that means that we are spending our time on the number one industry. But this is a timber area, and timber is so important to our way of life. You can't really build a wood house unless you have a tree. Over the next day, students will learn how to plant trees. Spread out your paper mulch. What's the paper They'll mulch? learn about the ecosystem in the area. Ah, oh, pay me, no, never mind. Techniques and tools of the past. Finally, they'll take a tractor ride up the mountainside to replenish areas left barren by fire. It's really beautiful here. Making students like Catriana not only a part of this decade-long legacy, but a part of the sustainability and beauty of Oregon's forest land. In Josephine County, Travis Cook, NBC5 News.